What is the difference between healing with love and complete acceptance? Well, we know they both arise from the same entity, the mind. Because we say, who is healing with love? Sorry, I'm recording a video. <laughs> um, who is healing? Who is the lover? Who is the complete acceptor of what is going on? And it's all the same thing. It's just the thought. You take it's just the mind. You take out the mind and there's no need to heal with love. There's no need to completely accept. Those are just games. But within this game, this agreement in language, which is going on, until it doesn't, uh, there's the way of thought that if somebody is deceased, that you could heal them with love, maybe some vibrations, I don't know. Um, you know, you form prayer circles and try to heal the body that way. The other way that I tend to um, gravitate towards is complete acceptance of what is going on. So as if there is a diseased body, there's a diseased body. You accept that. You go and not fight that, not say, you know, like, oh God, please heal me. Send me good vibrations to make my body better. But to completely accept everything that is a part of that body and the whole function of it. To go into, um, and completely accept that the body does get diseased. But to go deeper into that. Because it's a language. It's it's a it's a system of agreements. You have, you know, your blood cells, um, organs, DNA, chromosomes, um, um Oh my gosh, secretions, hormones for the glands, uh, all this stuff just interacting. And so there's agreements within the body. And as opposed to, like I was saying, to um, ask for healing, prayer circle, or the healing of love. Is to completely accept those agreements within the body, all the way down to cancer. That is still an agreement within the body. And yet we, we tend, you know, we don't want to go that deep. You know, we don't want to look at cancer and see what cancer is. We want to rid ourselves of cancer. Rid ourselves of the bad. And so we ask for others to heal us. But what I'm talking about is to look at the cancer directly, minutely, very much in what it is, and to accept it as it is, what it is. To see, it is a beautiful form, a beautiful agreement in itself, and of course, it it causes a body to die. There are more agreements. Family members that are attached feel very much grieved, sorrow over that because of those agreements of caring. 
all of this is to be completely accepted. When that happens, it's just peace. There's no need to ask others to pray for you, to heal you with love or energy. It's just this acceptance.